Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. Before you replace the sump filter in your front load washer, be sure to unplug the power cord. Have an assistant help you to move the appliance away from the wall. Using a Phillips head screwdriver or a number two square drive bit, unthread the rear screws securing the top panel. Remove the panel. Use needle nose pliers to help extend the spring to remove the retainer from the door boot seal. Peel the boot seal off the lip of the front panel. Lift and support the front of the washer. Unthread the four screws securing the bottom of the front panel. Pull out the dispenser drawer and depress the tab to fully release. Now unthread the two larger screws inside the dispenser drawer housing. Next, unthread the three screws securing the top of the front panel. Lift the front panel up and out to detach. Disconnect the two wire connectors to fully remove the panel. For better access, we recommend removing the lower counterbalance weight. Use a 7 16 inch socket to unthread the four mounting bolts. Set the weight aside. Using a 7 mm socket or nut driver, unthread the screw to loosen the wire clamp to release the coin trap hose from the outer tub. Next. Use pliers to release the three spring clamps securing the hose to the two circulation pumps and the drain pump. Pull the hose free. Remove the wire clamp and you can remove the old sump filter. Now pull the tabs back to release the cover. Prepare the new sump filter for installation by snapping on the cover. Fully insert the sump filter into the coin trap hose. Reposition the wire clamp. Reattach the hose to the appropriate ports on the drain pump and the circulation pumps and secure with the spring clamps.
Reattach the hose to the outer tub and tighten the screw to secure the wire clamp. If applicable, reposition the counterbalance weight on the outer tub and thread the mounting bolts. Reinstall the front panel by first connecting the control board wire connector and the door latch wire connector. Align the panel on the mounting pins and push down. Rethread the three screws on top. Replace the screws in the dispenser drawer housing. Reinstall the dispenser drawer. Rethread the four screws to secure the bottom of the front panel. Remove the support. Align the door boot seal on the lip of the front panel. Secure it with the retainer by aligning the spring at the top, then insert the retainer into the groove of the boot seal. Realign the top panel and secure it with the screws at the rear. Move the appliance back against the wall. Plug the power cord back in and your front load washer should be ready for use.